Hi, hope you're good, hope you're well, hope you're enjoying your life and having a good day. Um, so I don't have a like, script for this video, I haven't really been doing that because it's quite a lot of effort. I really should start doing that again because it makes my videos more structured and like informational rather than me like kind of chatting shit. But I wanted to do a video on can you recover from BPD? And short answer, I say no, but kind of yeah. But mainly no. <laughs> I believe if I went to go see a psychologist today I wouldn't be diagnosed with BPD. I don't think I fit the criteria for BPD nowadays like because I do feel like um, I've overcome most of the symptoms. It's more about learning how to live alongside it rather than learning to get rid of it completely but a lot of professionals say that you can't recover from it. One thing that's really helped me is um, DBT therapy which I did like a year ago, two years, two years ago now. It just gives you lots of like healthy coping mechanisms and um, distraction techniques loads of different helpful things. One thing that helps a lot of people is medication as well. You can use like holistic um, approaches like sounds odd but for me like um, spirituality and like witchcraft has been really helpful for my recovering. Like grounding techniques is a really important thing to learn when you have BPD especially if you struggle with dissociation. With grounding you just have to have all of the senses so that's why I like witchcraft can help because we're all into herbs and like essential oils, incense. A simple thing like making a cup of tea and holding it. Something as simple as listening to music can be so helpful with BPD. Like don't underestimate the power of the small things. It's so helpful, like don't underestimate that. Gratitude as well. Also like you have to take responsibility for yourself, for your recovery. BPD is not a life sentence. 86% of people with BPD stop meeting the criteria for BPD after at least four years. That is really good news. <laughs> it's hard to explain why like people say you can't recover from like you. Because it kind of is the way your brain is set. Like don't expect to not ever feel sad again and never feel the chronic emptiness again. A lot of people think that you can outgrow uh, your BPD, you can just basically grow up. And <laughs> I don't mean grow up, but I mean as you get older, you just learn how to cope. Oh my god, my eyelashes fully come off. Back to medication, although there's not like a specific medication for BPD itself, Things like SSRIs and antidepressants and mood stabilisers can be very effective in BPD recovery. So it's not curable, sadly, because it is considered a chronic illness, but people with borderline personality disorder can go into long-term remission. Why is this such a hard topic? Treatment is very important. Finding ways to cope and manage your condition is very important. With treatment you can live a more like rewarding, stable life. This topic's really difficult so if you could like leave a comment on your opinions that would be very helpful for me because it's just a difficult one. Like no it can't be cured but yes it kind of can. Did that make any sense? Was I chatting shit the whole time? Thank you for watching. Hope someone found it helpful. I'm just gonna quickly leave it on the note that this it is a disease and it may not be able to go away, but it can be managed in a way which properly like, affords you to have a better quality of life.